hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel if this is your first time welcome welcome my name is aisha and if you're an existing subscriber thanks for coming back to watch my video so in today's video i'll be talking about the questions i got about studying in romania so the first question I got is, are there job opportunities for international students while studying? Yes, there are job opportunities for international students while studying. Like if you want to work part-time, yes, there are job opportunities for international students while studying. And how much do they pay? The amount they pay depends on the type of job you want to work at. And the second question is, do you really have to show a proof of funds at the entry port? Yes, you have to show a proof of funds at the entry port if you are being asked. I remember vividly when I came to Romania, I was delayed for a good three hours. They asked how much is with me, which university am I going to? And yes, they will, they will kind of ask a few questions from you. Um, which country can you visit with the Romanian temporary resident card? You can visit countries like Bulgaria, Cyprus, or Croatia, of which I know that's true. The fifth question is, what are the things to bring when coming to Romania? Pack anything packable, but it's more advisable you don't bring a lot of things that you don't need or you know that you can get here like probably local ingredients from your country you can bring that as well things that you think like you might not find in Romania you can bring that but it's not really advisable to have like every luggages you know so it's not advisable to have every luggage but bring anything bringable <laughs> don't leave all don't leave all your documents as I don't think one it's not really important make sure you bring all your documents and probably for winter you can get like winter jackets here but if you think it's like more cheaper in your country but in order to avoid heavy luggages because it's like difficult to take luggages from one place to another so it's more advisable you don't like have something heavy so it's gonna be easy for you to carry the sixth question is, is it compulsory to stay in the hostel? No, it is not compulsory to stay in the hostel. If you want to get an apartment and you don't want to stay in the hostel, it is fine if you don't want to stay in the hostel. And the last question is, what are the most common part-time jobs in Romania? I think working in a restaurant, like as a waiter or waitress, or um, a call center or being a software developer, Thanks for watching my video. If you have any other questions, leave it in the comment section. I'll make sure I reply to all. Thank you all for subscribing. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share. Bye and see you in my next video.